welcome to the sexy toned arms workout we are going straight into the warm-up of arm rotations your core is nice and engaged your feet are nice and wide and you are rotating your arms nice and big this workout is so good if you just want to tighten and tone your arms, if you're getting ready for a vacation, bikini season, or anything where you're going to be showing your arms, this workout is one you need in your routine. We're going next into side hops. You're going to just gently hop from side to side. This is to get your whole body nice and warmed up, to get your mind into the game because this is such a good workout. It is so effective. The moves we're going to be doing are designed to get you the best results in the shortest amount of time possible. So let's do it together. This is going to be a good one. Next up, we have chest expansions. Your legs are nice and wide and you are just hugging the whole world. <laughs> when you do this, you want to make sure that your shoulder blades are touching at the back if possible. Awesome, finally we're doing another exercise to get your whole body warm, jumping jacks. Just go at your own pace, we want your whole body, your whole body to be warm so you can get the most out of this workout. Okay, round one, we are doing tricep extensions. Your back is nice and rigid, your abs are engaged, and you are using the back of your arms to control this movement. That area that likes to be flabby and jiggle when you clap, yeah, that's the area we're targeting. So really think about that muscle, concentrate, and extend your triceps. Awesome. I'm using weights in this workout because when you use weights, you get faster results and it helps, really helps to tone that area. If you don't have weights, you can do this exercises without weights, but I highly recommend you try to incorporate some weights. Good. You're doing good. Keep going. I like it. I like it. I like it. You're going to feel this in the back of your arms. That was perfect. We're going straight into curl to press. Your feet are wide, your abs are engaged. You're going to curl your arms up and then raise them up to the ceiling. This is such a good exercise for the front of your arms, your shoulders, and your entire arms. So it gets all your arm muscles in just one movement. It is so effective. Let's do it together. Keep going, you're doing good. The good thing about this workout is that it's super short, so you can just do it and know you're done for the day. Keep going. Keep that core engaged. Oh yes. You are going to be looking so good. You already look amazing, but now you're going to look even more amazing. Keep going. That was really, really good. Next up, we have hammer curls. Your abs are engaged and you're just touching your chest. Huh, huh, huh. Got it? All right, let's go. Let's do it together. This is a really good exercise that tones the front and back of your arms. It gives your shoulders a nice workout. There is a little bit of work for your abs as well actually in this, but it's really, really good for the arms. So just control that movement. You don't really want to be swinging your arms. You want to really control this nice and slow. You're getting this. You are doing so good. Just a few more seconds. Okay, that was awesome. That was just so good. This is the last exercise before you get a break. This is a crush press. You're going to keep your abs engaged, your feet wide, and you're going to just extend your weights in front of you. You want to keep your weight at chest level throughout this movement and try to control this movement without releasing your abs. Let's do it. 
I know this is one of those ones that looks very simple but then you start to do it and you're like wait am I doing it right don't worry you're doing it right you are working out today and that is awesome keep going Try to keep those weights at about chest level. Control the movement. Oh, you are doing good. Just a few more seconds before your break. Hang in there. You got this. That was amazing. Take a full minute to rest. You can pause the timer and take a longer rest if you need it. Go ahead and subscribe to my YouTube channel if you haven't done so already. It's totally free for you and it means so much to me. I'll be back after the break to keep working out with you. Welcome back. We are going straight into a variation of tricep extensions. Your feet are together, your abs are engaged, and you are lifting your weights up and over your head using the muscles at the back of your arms. Those muscles that like to jiggle when you clap. Yeah, those ones. Let's go. We're doing this together and I believe in you. Let's go. Really squeeze that muscle at the back of your arms. There, good, good, good. Next up, we have a bicep curl to overhead press. You're going to curl your arms and then raise your arms. Curl your arms and then raise your arms. Make sure your abs are engaged throughout this movement and your feet are nice and wide to give you a good base. Let's go. You're doing it. You're doing it right. Let me tell you, you look amazing already, okay? Keep going. Nice and slow and controlled. Almost there. Almost there. Just keep pushing. There. There you go. You're do almost there. Keep going. Perfect. Next up, we have those hammer curls again. Abs nice and engaged. Feet nice and wide. And you are just touching your chest. Why do I keep saying it like that? Let's do it together. <laughs> After this, you have one more exercise and we get to cool down. Didn't that go really fast? You nailed it. You did so good today. Keep going. Nice and controlled. If you need a quick break to release your arms, do so, but get right back into it. Keep going. You're almost there. Yes, last exercise, side raises. Abs are engaged. You have a slight bend in your knee and you're just raising your arms to be parallel with your shoulders. You got it? All right, we're gonna do this one together. This is our last exercise. We can do this, you can do this. Let's go.
Don't rush, slow and steady. You made it to the end and you got this. Good, good job. You're looking so good, keep going, keep going. Just push through, almost there. Yes, good job, let's cool down. Just go ahead and clasp your hands together over your head and give yourself a nice stretch in your back and shoulders. This is like the stretch you do when you wake up in the morning. Oh, feels so good. You did so good. That was amazing. I am, I am impressed. Go ahead and stretch out those triceps. The back of your arms have worked so hard today. Stretch them out. Shake it out and do the second arm as well. You did so good today. It's unbelievable. I'm so proud of you. Stretch out your shoulders as well. Just keep that arm straight and you should feel a nice gentle stretch in your shoulder as you do this. Go ahead and switch your arms to the other side as well. Give yourself a huge hug and just twist from side to side. I just want you to know that you are doing amazing things for yourself and I am here for you. You got this. You can reach your goals and you worked out today. That's kind of a big deal. That is kind of a big deal. Thank you so much for working out with me today. Subscribe to my YouTube channel if you haven't done so already, and I will see you in my next workout video.